Growing up, I had dreams and aspirations, but always felt like the kid that didn't fit in. For the most part, I wasn't a bad kid, but when I made the transition into adulthood, I turned to the streets for guidance. This led to getting locked up in juvenile hall, doing time in CYA, and eventually a 120 month sentence in federal prison. I had a lot of time to think and reflect during my federal sentence. So I share with you what I learned, hoping I can positively influence someone else's life with Prison Talk. What's up? Big Herc 916, getting down with Fresh Out. You know how we do it over here. Smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, share the channel, represent, and go to freshoutseries.com, subscribe to the website, and pick you up some merch. You know, we got that men's panel going down July 30th, 1 p.m. Pacific time, private invite. Shoot me an email, info.bigherc916 at gmail.com if you want to get that special invite so you can tap in. This is a story that hasn't been talked about a whole lot, even though it's a major story. Oprah spiritual healer, John of God, receives 99 year sentence for trafficking operation. Yeah, man, John of God. He was the guy that rarely did interviews. He was the spiritual healer. He was down to South America, but he was up to no good. He was a piece of shit. In a stunning turn of events, uh, Ajo Texeria, Texeria de Feria, widely known as John of God, I butchered that name, so excuse me, I don't know how to pronounce that properly, but John of God and Oprah Winfrey's former spiritual healer has been sentenced to 99 years in prison after being found guilty of heinous crime, including rape and abuse against over 600 women and young girls. Shockingly, further investigations have revealed his involvement in baby trafficking operation where newborn children were sold to childless couples. Now, how are you kicking it with a cat that's doing all this shit and you ain't peeping game? You ain't seen this, this, this dude's moves? This guy right here, man, damn, 600 women and young girls, that's a whole lot. Wow. Drawn from information obtained from major news outlets and reputable sources, the gravity of Hoha's Ho crimes becomes apparent. The queues operate in Brazil, where young girls were reportedly held captive in isolated farms, enduring unimaginable abuse and being forced to produce babies. Heartbreakingly, these victims were reported to be murdered after 10 years of giving birth. God, what the hell? What the hell? And we talk about sound of freedom? Man, I'm telling you, there are some demons going around in the world that need to be burnt at the stake. The revelations of Hoa's actions are both chilling and disturbing. One activist whose tireless investigations led to his arrest has spoken with women from Europe the USA and Australia, who admitted to purchasing Brazilian babies for as much as $50,000. The harrowing accounts underscore the extent of the criminal network that John of God was involved in and a global impact of his atrocities. So this guy wasn't just operating in Brazil. He was selling babies across the world. Who, who could move like that? Who could get all these passwords for the babies and and in contact and network, it ain't a one man operation, man. Hell no. The news has sent shockwaves through communities worldwide, including among prominent figures who have previously expressed admiration for the spiritual healer. Former U.S. President Bill Clinton acclaimed actress Shirley MacLaine, supermodel Naomi Campbell, former Brazilian President Luis Inacio Lula da Silva have all been associated with John of God in the past heightening disbelief and horror surrounding the case. As these shocking revelations come to light, it is essential to emphasize the gravity of the crimes committed and the need for justice to be served. The impact on the victims, their families, and the global community cannot be overstated. The sentencing of John of God to 99 years in prison 
a significant step towards holding him accountable for the immense suffering he inflicted on hundreds of innocent women and children. While the details of the case are distressing, it is crucial to recognize the bravery of those who came forward to expose the truth and bring this, this predator to justice. Their actions shed light on the urgent need to address and combat sexual abuse and human trafficking on a global scale. As the shock sub subsides, discussions on preventing such heinous crimes and ensuring the safety and well-being of vulnerable individuals must continue. The legal proceedings against John of God serve as a stark reminder that no individual, regardless of reputation or stature, should be immune from the consequences of their actions. Yeah, put this cat on the main line. Put him on the main line. He's down in Brazil. They gonna pop him. They gonna get the blinky and pop his ass. Yeah, buddy, you getting popped in more ways than one. Can you say cheek buzz? Can you say blinky? Can you say ouch? In conclusion, the sentencing of spiritual healer John of God to 99 years in prison for rape, abuse, and his involvement in a baby trafficking operation has sent shockwaves throughout the world. Horrific nature of his crimes coupled with the revelation of prominent figures associated with him underscore the gravity of the situation. As justice is served, it is crucial to acknowledge the victims, support effort to combat sexual abuse and human trafficking, and work collectively to prevent such atrocities from occurring again. Let's bring all these pieces of shit to justice. Big Herc 916, fresh out. Lockdown's over. Get your yard time in. Exclusively at FreshOutSeries.com. Hello, my name is Big Kirk 916 and I'm from the Wash Your Ass Committee. And I'm here to help you clean your booty hole. So I have some scents here that I would like to share with you. I have um, Festival. I have Butt Naked Scrub. I have some Oatmeal Milk and Honey. I have uh, Jamaican Me Crazy Festival. Um, you can take a pick from one of these, these scents and wash your ass, make your body feel better about itself, get rid of the funk. And I would like to make sure I can give you a good deal. So let me know. Go to FreshOutSeries.com, pick you up a bar, and please wash your ass.